In this presentation, we'll be examining the pedigree of some of the characters from the Lord of the Rings. The Roman numerals here represent the generations in this pedigree, so we have three generations. The squares are the males and the circles are the females. We'll be examining the height trait in this pedigree. Big A gives the tall allele and little a gives the short allele. To analyze in a more simplified manner, we'll simplify the pedigree for each mode of inheritance. Any individual that is shaded has the trait, while any that are unshaded do not have the trait. We'll examine if different types of modes of inheritance are consistent with the pedigree. First, we'll look at the X-linked dominant mode of inheritance. Since it's X-linked dominant, any individual with a dominant allele has to have the trait. Since Elrond has the trait, he has a dominant allele on X, while Celebrion is homozygous recessive since she does not have the trait. Their daughter Erwin does not have the trait, but she is a carrier since she receives one allele from each of her parents. However, we see that this does not make sense because any individual with a dominant allele has to have the trait. Therefore, we can say that this mode of inheritance is inconsistent. Next, we have the X-linked recessive mode of inheritance. This proves to be a consistent mode of inheritance since all genotypes correlate with each individual's trait. In the autosomal dominant mode of inheritance, any individual with a dominant allele will have the trait. Elrond has the trait because he is heterozygous dominant, while Celebrion doesn't have it because she is homozygous recessive. Their daughter Erwin is homozygous recessive and so is Aragorn. In order for Eldarion to have the trait, he needs to get at least one dominant allele from either or both of his parents. This mode of inheritance is inconsistent because neither of his parents have the trait nor are they carriers. In the autosomal recessive mode of inheritance, all genotypes correlate with each individual's traits, and therefore we can say that this is a consistent mode of inheritance. Finally, we have the Y-linked mode of inheritance. Here, any individual that has a dominant allele on the Y chromosome will have the trait. Elrond has the trait because he is Y-linked dominant. However, he cannot pass it on to his daughter because females only have XX chromosomes, while males can only have XY chromosomes. Therefore, we can conclude that this is an inconsistent mode of inheritance. 